As new variants of the coronavirus are detected around the world and land here in the U.S., pharmaceutical companies are trying to keep up. Moderna announced this week that it will be conducting more testing on booster shots to help better protect against these emerging strains. KXAN's Tahir Rahman spoke with a virus expert who explains why that's important. I've been trying um, for several weeks. Jeanette Larson and her husband got the Moderna vaccine at her doctor's office Monday, the same day a new variant of the virus from Brazil was found in the United States. Globally, we think there's four or five of these now. Dr. Rodney Rohde specializes in virology and microbiology. He says so far we found COVID-19 mutants in these four places. It's still kind of the same virus and makeup, but these little regions change just a little bit. And so that means that that lock and key, that antibody, it's kind of lock and key fit, may not work as well. It does not mean it quits working. Rody says while variants are expected, too much of a change can become a problem. The typical antibodies that the human body uh, produces may not recognize it at all or very weakly. Our vaccine may not be as effective. This week, Moderna's CEO said they think their vaccine is still effective against some new strains, but they will start more tests on booster shots, quote, out of an abundance of caution. Is that a relief? Oh, amazingly. Larson says she's still glad they were able to get their vaccine and plans to keep guard against whatever is next. We'll still wear our masks, so we'll still try to be as careful as, as we've been. Bahira Rahman, KXAN News. We also reached out to Pfizer about what they are doing to test against the new strains of COVID-19. They say early studies show their vaccine is still effective on the United Kingdom and South Africa variants, but they also say they need to make sure the data is certain. Moderna says it is on track to deliver 100 million doses to the U.S. government by March. The company says it's also on pace to have a total of 200 million doses by the end of the second quarter. So far, they've supplied more than 30 million doses to the federal government. Earlier this month, Moderna announced it would supply at least 600 million doses around the world this year. Meanwhile, in Austin, Benchmark Research says they're planning to conduct research on the Moderna vaccine on teenagers. Austin is one of the seven nationwide locations for the Research Institute. Benchmark Research says the trial still has not started, but they're seeing a good number of volunteers come forward. They're looking for 25 participants, but hope to screen triple that number as some will not qualify. Benchmark says they're still in need of more adults to participate in Novavax vaccine trials for COVID-19. Their goal is 300 people, but only 157 are currently enrolled.